The Curse of the Pharaohs is the latest expansion pack in Assassin's Creed Origins. It takes our main protagonist Bayek to a massive new region south of the main game's map, which includes locations such as the Valley of the Kings, Thebes, and much more. The expansion starts off with a warning about some strange stories coming out of Thebes, and of course, Bayek needs to go and investigate these strange happenings. Quickly, the player finds themselves face to face with an undead pharaoh of Old Kingdom Egypt. You are then thrown into a wild goose chase all over the new region and into many regions of the afterlife to uncover mysteries of the old pharaohs and discover what is behind this curse that now plagues the land. At first this story sounds quite ridiculous, I myself was very skeptical going in. However, this expansion isn't just the largest Assassin's Creed has ever delivered in their games, in my mind it is also probably the most well executed expansion they've ever done. The Curse of the Pharaohs expansion mirrors the main game in many ways in terms of its qualities. The story, though interesting, can at times lack focus and clarity. With so many bits of Egyptian history and philosophy being delved deep into this expansion, I found myself getting quite confused about which pharaohs or gods were being discussed at certain points, while also again being quite confused with the main villain's motivations overall. But, like the main game again, this expansion is endlessly fun, with all the same great gameplay qualities and some fantastic new additions. The new region that this expansion introduces, though massive and full of plenty to do, was absolutely blown away by the awesomeness of the four afterlife regions representative of a dead Egyptian pharaoh's afterlife realm. Each feeling completely unique in their visuals, their tone, and their overall dangers with each holding a boss fight with that particular dead pharaoh's shadow, which was probably the most fun boss fights in Assassin's Creed Origins overall, not just this expansion. My standout favourite being Ramses, whose afterlife was representative of his battles and his conquest during his life, so to battle a massive undead pharaoh surrounded by the ruins and corpses of fallen men in battle made it just so intense and just completely epic. I was really blown away with the amount of content that the Curse of the Pharaohs expansion introduced. With the new region alone, I was satisfied with the amount to explore and do in terms of locations and side content. Though again, like the main game, some things were more interesting than others. The constant threat though of undead pharaohs popping up around the map made it feel like the world we were exploring was at least somewhat connected to the story taking place alongside of it, which for me is a big plus. On top of that, the side content from each of the afterlife regions gave their own unique stories for Bayek that kind of connected back to what happened in the original campaign and tied character points up really well I thought. Bayek again is the star of this expansion. The performance by Abubakar Salim was again A plus for me and only made me want more and more Bayek in the future. With this DLC tying up things with this character, while also giving some hints that leave some story points open for the future, so my fingers are crossed. Look, overall, the Curse of the Pharaohs expansion was absolutely fantastic. I thoroughly enjoyed my entire time with it. It may not have been perfect, but it was endlessly fun. And really, what more do you want out of video games than to have fun with them? It is definitely in my mind the best DLC Assassin's Creed's ever released, and if you get the chance to play it, then I highly recommend you do so. So that's it for this quick review of Assassin's Creed Origins, The Curse of the Pharaohs. Hope you enjoyed it, ladies and gentlemen. Please like this video and subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I will see you guys next time.